Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome to another MAMJ Let's Play of the Cat Lady. When we left off, we were trying to figure out how to trick, um, this lady right here into giving me her wristband. I forgot what her name was. Anne? Something like that. You <clears throat> really are a friend. Yeah, so we gotta figure out what her mom's name, name is. Me. But I know it. And I've tried every single name here. Yes, Anne Burton is her name. I don't know. Leave me a... But anyway, so one of my friends suggested that we put the shard of glass under her pillow. So let me see if I can do that. Uh, glass shard. Oh, crap. Use. I can't think of any use for it here. Okay, so it won't let me... Can I put the band there? Uh, how can this help me escape from this horrible place? Okay. Well, I don't think that's what I need to do. Well, that sucks. Because I was going to try and... I don't know. I'm going to try and distract the nurse again. And see if that will give me an opportunity to find something that I missed. Maybe. So let's go in here. Ring the bell. Oh, crap. Wait. I didn't... No! I didn't flood the toilet. Oh no! Um, no, nobody answered. Nobody answered. No one's home. Nobody's here. Ah, oh, crap. Um, ha, hi. Crap. This is bad. Have you rang the bell? Is there an emergency? No. I just wanted to remind you that I'm ready to go home. Oh, these are new. I pressed it by mistake. Sorry. I wanted to see how long it takes you to answer the bell. I'm feeling a bit woozy. Uh. Yeah, why not? I'm feeling a bit woozy. <clears throat> Are you really? Yes. You look fine to me. Uh, well, no, shut your face. I, I'm really not feeling well. Fine. I'll call the doctor for you. But I can't help it if he's busy and can't get here straight away. All right, give me In some drugs. In the meantime, I know how to make you feel better. Maybe I can give them to Anne I or something. I think it's time we give you some medication. Can you please tell okay. me your name and your date of birth? My name and date of birth. Isn't Ashworth? Are you kidding me? Mind your own business. I'm not taking anything. I'll have your name so I can make a big fat complaint. Ann Burton. Uh? Is that gonna help me in any way? <clears throat> if I get her drugs... then I should have turned that faucet off, it's really loud. If I get her drugs, then maybe I can use them somehow... to get her mom's info out of her? I don't Anne know. Burton, born in 1975. Yes. Let me just I doubt she's gonna. Oh, of course. Crap. The band. Miss Ashworth, I mm. think you got a little confused there. I figured Drink she would know just by now. looking at me. It'll make you all better. Liquid. Take that. Mm. I'd, I'd rather Are not. Are you insane? Mm -mm. I'm not taking any medication. I'm not ill. Well, we did say that we weren't feeling okay. well. Okay, we are prepared for this. What do you mean? Jim. Can you come in, please? Jim? No. No, we don't need Jim. Hi, you Jim. must be kidding me. We're good. We're, no, we're fine. Unfortunately, I'm not. You and your I'm wig glasses. You an injection. No. -uh. I feel a sharp scratch. Hold it for me, would you? Can I get my Can I get my mirror? Can I fight back? That's kind of a weird animation there. Oh, God. Okay, so I'm guessing Go that was your room and rest. bad idea. You'll be able to relax and get <clears throat> great sleep. Dang it. Whoa, what? S H A What is this? S H A. S H A. <clears throat> Wait. Cause wasn't there a fr la, uh, uh, I wanna say it was lie, but it, I was reading it backwards, it's E I L. S H E I Sheila? Is that her name? This is the mom's name. She why why now in this tripped out <clears throat> drug trance? Okay, that sounds weird. No, thank you. Okay. Do Whoa. Okay, this is trippy. This is trippy. Hi, door. Uh, this is where I'm staying. Hopefully, not much longer. Okay, this is really trippy. What is that? 
Narcotic heart. Are there the files here? No. That looks weird. Examine. So hard to concentrate. Is this thing filled with drugs? I don't know. I have the glass. Can I use it? What am I doing with my life? Oh! Narcotic. Examine. Red liquid is gushing. Yeah? Hang on, hang on. The, the, the medicine stuff. This. Use. I'll fill it with this drug. What am I doing? Examine. What is exactly how they get it? It's all a bit blurry. I can't remember much. I don't think she should drink it. That, that seems really gross. Should I give it to Anne? What happens if I drink it? I'm, I'm, I know it's messed up, but I, I, I'm kind of curious. I've had enough drugs already drinking this would probably kill me. Okay. Okay. Sorry about that, narcotic heart. What is going on? I'm drugged up. I think I figured out the name to the mom. And now I've got this random bed. Okay, lie down. Yes, lying down is good. Do you have to do it super creepy? Can you just lay like a normal kind of sane person would? Whoa, okay. No, I actually do. I still have those drugs. The drugs have worn off and I feel better now. Yeah, I bet but you I do. can't let them do that to me again. I need to get out of here. Okay, so that was necessary. I needed to get drugged. Sounds really weird. Uh, what happens if I... Can I drink it? I don't know why I'm so obsessed about that. But can I drink it? Uh, no. Okay. What? What's the point of that, then? Alright, let's get out of here. Okay, your mom's name. I you think really I know it. Friend. You will know my mother's name. <clears throat> if it's not it's Sheila... That haunts me. I just a give up on everything. Name. But I know it. Let me just think for a second. Okay. Oh, come on! It's the only option now? It's literally the only option. So, even if you didn't piece it together, apparently it's it's handed to you. Sheila. Okay. Sheila. Yes. It was my mother who sent you, after all. It was. I'm sorry I didn't believe you. It's okay. But my head's all messed up. Yeah, you're still wobbling. A so, lot. So, let's have a little chat, sweetheart. Ooh, talking time. Do you know how to get out of this place? Do you know how to get out of here? We're not supposed to get out. <clears throat> we must stay here. Mm -hmm. Do what they say. Take pills they give us. Sometimes, if I behave, they give me the red stuff. The red stuff? I wait for it. I'm being good. The red stuff? What is this red stuff? I think I have it. It's a drug. My favorite one. <laughs> Your favorite red stuff drug? takes the pain away. The oh, God. I must stay here. Uh -huh. Good nurses have been most kind. They always remember. Mm -hmm. They know I'm suffering. Ah. But it is not the same as the drugs I see in my dreams. On the other I side of the mirror, drugs. there's a spider's heart full of drugs. I just can't seem to find it anymore. What? I see. We have the same hallucination? What exactly is this little treat you mentioned? Are you alright? Feel like sharing what's your name? How about we swap our name bands? Let's not do that quite yet. Okay. What exactly <clears throat> is this little treat? Sorry, my throat is just mentioned. allergies suck. It's the red teardrop of pure happiness. Oh, you, they really bring now? It. I drink it down, mm -hmm. and my pain goes away. All away. Without it, I just feel so angry. Don't it's feel like angry. I'm going crazy. <laughs> it's funny, but mm -mm, I just funny. get so fucking angry sometimes. Okay, calm down. It's all right. I'm dying. I think. Yeah, probably. We're all dying, I heard. She said I'd go to hell for it, but I didn't do anything. Who, what? I didn't know. Does he know? Who? Him! Him, of course. Right. P okay. Professor X? No, probably not. I need the red medicine. I need it now. Okay, I can give it to you. I must be a good girl. I must be a nice girl. Maybe I could get you some of that stuff. Do you know where they keep it? In Drugtown oh, Happy Land. Well, you can't get there. 
No, I well, did. Maybe you can. I, I did. I done did it. I see it in my dreams sometimes. Why did she say it's dreams where the like that? Are. But in my dream, there are no nurses <coughs> there. Mm -mm. I see it, but I can't get it. You have to stab it. It's so near, and yet so far. Ah. Uh, I can still hear the broken heartbeat of the spider's heart. Spider. Uh. I feel like sharing. What's your name? I'm. I'm gonna try and swap. How about we swap She's our not name bands? Oh yeah. I don't mind. Are you serious? But that would be like a favor to you, yeah? No. Well, technically, you wouldn't lose anything. It's true. Because I'd give you my name band instead. Does that make any sense? Sure. Yeah. Is she gonna go I for it? I do want something better in return, though. I'm not that stupid. Ah. I know you'll use it to get out of here. Oh, oh. I never nice. said you're stupid. I, I just really want to go home. Please understand. That's fine. I don't mind. You really don't care. I'll give it to you if you get me the red stuff. What do you say? I thought nurses give it to you anyway. No, not that. I'm talking about the real thing. How? Something My you brain. only get in the world of dreams. Now that ah. is something special. I don't get it. I don't get is how she it? knows of it. Safe. I thought that was just Perfectly tripping. Perfectly safe. Trip it out. Um, okay. I'll see what I can do. Okay, uh, so how do I give it to her? I guess I'll talk, talk to, to you later. later. Yeah? Yes. Go. Be She's careful. They're watching dead set us. on that. And remember, we must be nice to earn the red stuff. No, I just stabbed Always the heart. Be nice. Mm -mm. Where are you going? Where are you going? Don't run away. Okay, so. I have it. Lucky me. Give. Oh, that's awesome. I found the thing you asked me for. That's great. But are you absolutely certain it won't harm you? Don't be silly. Of course it won't. Is she just going to vomit blood and die? Fine. I hope you know what you're doing. <sighs> Can I have your name band now, please? Dig it. Yes. No matter what they say, I do keep my promises. No matter who what says. What do they? You know what? It doesn't matter. <laughs> She's like, I don't care anymore. I just want to get out of here. Thank you for your help. Am I outie? Where's she going? Is she gonna die or something? Where's she going? Uh. Mm -mm -mm. Alright, so I've already read all that. Is she in here? Nope. Alright. Where'd she go? Sub nurse, I'm out. See you later. All right. Sorry, ma'am, can't <clears throat> let you through. It's I'm okay. going to see a discharge letter from your doctor first. Here. Are you happy now? Yes, that seems fine. Thank you. Can I just check your name band to confirm that you are indeed Anne Burst? Do it. Oh, all right. I didn't know <coughs> you knew how to read. Oh, snap. There you go. Can I go now? Of course. Thank you. Yes! I'll oh. see you soon. What do you mean, see you soon? No. You won't. Now get out of my way. Ooh, she's getting all confrontational like. Why do I have this glove? Oh, more stuff? Storage room door. It's locked. Okay. Uh. It's a door to some office. Should I just. Be okay, it's locked. Never mind. I can't do anything. Dime ward, maternity ward, and exit. Oh, God! You're and not creepy. You must be Susan Ashworth. No, I'm not. Um, well, perhaps I am. Do you mind if I ask you where you're heading to? The maternity ward? I was ward? just going for a little walk. Stretch my legs. Ah. Get some fresh air. Crap. Double crap. Run. Give it a rest. I'm not going anywhere. Run. Miss Ashworth, please relax. They're gonna drug me again, aren't There's they? been a mistake. <clears throat> you have been prescribed wrong medication. Oh, really? I apologize sincerely on behalf of my team and the hospital. But luckily, we oh. managed to spot it on time. Oh, yeah. On time. You have no idea what I've been through? Once again, I'm truly sorry. 
I promise no more drugs will be given to you. Oh, really? I personally guarantee you will have a good, peaceful sleep tonight. And you can what? be discharged in the morning. Why can't I go tonight? I want to go now. Why would I'm they really just let me sorry, go? sorry, but we can't legally discharge suicidal patients without a full psychiatric assessment. Mm, okay. It's too late for it now. But I promise we'll have a chat in my office first thing in the morning, okay? okay. And then you can go home. Is that all right? I haven't really got much choice, have I? Nope. Well. Now I'd like to ask you some questions about your Dang life. Dang it, that sucks. You might find them very personal. But it's important that you answer me as honestly as possible. Fine. All right. Let's get <clears throat> over with then, shall we? Yes, let's do this. I'd like to go home at last. Of course, I understand. He's kind of creepy. So, Susan, let's see. Are you living alone at the moment? Uh, random flat. It's quite lonely most of the time. I live on my own. This is me just fine. I live with a friend. She must be worried sick about me. No. Besides teacup, not really. Rent or live. It felt more like a flat. I rent a <clears> flat. <throat> it's quite lonely most of the time. I used to like being on my own, but I'm not sure if I still do. Oh, Too much time with my thoughts. And no one to talk to. Maybe I should get a parrot. We'd have if a little cats. chat each time I feel like opening Are you up. Serious? Or maybe you could consider finding friends through our suicide watch service. Yeah, well, that's not gonna good. happen. Helped a lot of people. Mm -mm. Okay. Maybe I will. She's not gonna. What do you do for a living? <clears throat> I love cats. Uh, between jobs or a waitress? I am a waitress. I'm a waitress. I work in a cafe. You do? Yes. Do you like it? Yes, that's it's why I tried okay. to kill myself. I don't mind it. It's just a job. It's important to keep busy. I'd advise you get back to work as soon as next week. How about tomorrow? Describe to me what your mornings look like. Well, the sun's what out. What is the first thing you do each day? Wake up. Drink strong coffee and smoke on the balcony. Eat breakfast cereal usually. I have a cup of tea and read a newspaper. I lie in bed awake. I can't bring myself to open my eyes. I go to the toilet, doesn't everyone? I put the TV on so I can watch old TV shows. Um. Mm, well. I'm gonna say. She doesn't seem like the cup of tea and newspaper type or cereal. Uh, do you smoke? Do you smoke, Susan? The toilet one's kind of funny. Yeah, why not? She goes to the toilet. Go to the toilet. Doesn't anyone? Doesn't everyone? everyone? Fair enough. What <laughs> is the next thing you do then? Oh, I don't know. I just muddle through, I guess. Don't think there's any routine to it. It depends how I feel that day. Would you say that you feel safer at home than outside? Um. Yeah, why I, not? She doesn't like people. Yeah. I'm trying to be as I, true I to her character as I think it would be. It's not really about <clears throat> safety. I've just felt sad for a long time now. Oh, so really sad, sad, feeling sad. You know? Yes. Somehow it brings me down even more when I go out and see all those happy, successful people. Jerks. It makes me feel more like a failure if I don't see it. God, she's it so hard on herself. What do you think is missing in your life? Sky or rather, what is one thing that you think would make your life better? More cats. Uh, it would be nice to have more money, I guess. A good friend, someone I can finally trust. I, I know it's silly, but I wish I was better looking. Ridiculously good looking. Uh, something to fight for, you know, a reason to go on. Man, this is deep. I didn't think it was going to be this involved. Uh, she, I don't think she needs money. People... I think she needs a reason to go on. Something to fight for. Yeah. You know? A reason to go on. There's always a reason to live. Sometimes we just don't see it that clearly. Well, okay. Doctor, I must have gone all blind then, because I can't see any. 
Have you ever attended group therapy for depression or some other form of counseling? Mm. I don't think so. No. No. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure it's a good idea. Yeah, take that. Especially the group therapy thing. I'd hate it. I hate it. You should at least give it a go first, and then decide. If you don't like it, <sighs> we can think of something else, yeah? If you insist. But I doubt it'll help. When can we go home? Do you have problems sleeping? No, I have sleeping pills. What do you think? Every night. I take uh, pills for that. There you go. There aren't any left now, though. Yeah, they all kind of. In the got light taken. of recent events, I think you should stay off those pills for a while. I suggest you drink some hot milk before bed instead. What am I, a cat? Would you describe for me how you feel at the moment? Like a cat. I feel fine now. Definitely better than before the accident. I feel like the whole world is against me. Uh. I don't want to make her sound too depressed because then I'm not going to be able to get out. So we'll just say she feels better. Definitely better than yeah. You know, progress is happening. Accident. Mm -hmm. Good. Hopefully, you can now move on from here. Thank you, Professor. With X. a bit of luck, you will enjoy life again. Suicide attempts often have that effect on people. Same as near-death experience. It makes you realize that you're not ready to die yet. There's very few instances where people are Do you find it hard to, to concentrate? When you talk to me, yes. Uh, no, not really, yes, sometimes. Yeah. Yes. Sometimes. Do you drink alcohol, Susan? Mmm. I... Uh, no, no, she doesn't. That's good. Yes. Alcohol is a powerful depressant. I never really liked drinking. Excellent. Excellent. Sometimes when life gets too much and people feel sad or upset, they think about suicide. Do you often think about suicide? What kind of question is this? No, of course not. I don't know what got into me. Well, I used to think about it. sometimes. I yes, I think about it often. Uh, let's say sometimes. Let's let's say that she sometimes thinks about it, and then she just kind of acted well, on this one instance. I used to think about it sometimes. Don't you think about it when you're really down? Susan, I'm a psychiatrist. <laughs> My job is to talk people out of I'm it. I'm above that. Would you ask a fireman if he ever thinks about setting fire to his house? What? I suppose not. Would but you I'm ask sure a fireman if he wants to put out a fire in his house? About it. I couldn't say, Susan. The statistics show that men are three times more likely than women to commit suicide. Oh, we're in the top quarter. That puts you in the minority. But oh. of course, that's missing the point. No, it's not. Suicide is never the solution. There's always a way of solving whatever problem you might have. Revenge. I realize that now. Please, in your own words, try to explain to me why did you really try to take your own life, Susan? I don't know. Sudden impulse, uh, nothing was making me happy anymore. I wanted to show everyone how hurt I was deep inside. There's nobody to show, that, is there? We kind of killed off her mom and her dad left her, so with this one. Nothing was making me happy anymore. There wasn't a single thing that would bring a smile to my face. Not even cats. I kept thinking, won't it be better if I just disappear? I tried. I really tried to find something. Took a long bath. Mm -hmm. Picked up a book. Ooh, did you read watched it? Watched some television. But I just couldn't get into anything. All those things seemed like worthless distractions. And I myself felt obsolete. Needless. She's so sad. It just would get worse and worse. By the afternoon, I realized I cried for the past three hours. I... I didn't even know I'd been crying until I went to the bathroom and saw my face in the mirror. Mm. I looked like a ghost. I looked like I was dead already, you know? And then I saw the sleeping pill. Ah, this is dark. I thought, this is really dark. why not? And I did it. Do you feel okay. as if you're a burden? Or that life isn't worth living? Uh... I don't think she's really changed that much Sometimes, since the incident. When I feel I think really she just low, wants to get I out. Just, I used to think everyone would be happier without me. 
but I guess people don't really care. Besides, I live alone. Who could I be a burden to? What makes you feel better? Cats. <laughs> it's an actual choice. Uh, work used to make me feel happy. Antidepressants really did it for me. A long bath. Music. Cats. My I cats. love cats. I, I love always every put kind out of cat. a bowl of food for the stray cats. They're ever so grateful. Mm. I like their company. What makes you feel worse? Um... People let me down too many times. I hate it when it rains all the time. Noise. Too much noise. Really upsets me. Loneliness. I wish I had someone to talk to. It's hard to say it could be anything. Mm, raining? That's, that's silly. Noise. I doubt she'd get depressed over noise. Uh, I guess we're going to go with people. People. They've let me down too many times. I don't know who to trust anymore. I only trust my cats these days. Mm. So you say in the suicide note. Because that's oh, really? true. I've been stabbed in the back more times than I could count. Have you imagined your funeral and how people will react to your death? Is that something you should ask someone who tried to kill themselves? Uh, I imagine often I hope people feel guilty. Probably nobody to come anyway. I never really thought about that. I don't think. Oh, you know, I never really. It's thought kind of a weird question that. to ask somebody. But I guess it would be a cheap one. I don't really know what they do with people like me. Maybe they just throw us in a hole and forget about it. <laughs> since there'd be nobody to visit my grave anyway. I don't think so, Susan. The city would pay for it. Or so they want people to believe. Finally, Snap. I'd like you to tell me about Eric. Eric? Eric? Who's Eric? Yes, your husband. Whoa, she's married. I believe this might be important. Let's get to that what daughter thing. What can you tell thing. me about your relationship? Because she doesn't have a daughter. What had happened between you two? Uh, I, I don't really want to talk about this. That's nothing to do with him. Can I go home now, please? Nothing to talk about. It's getting late. Can we talk about it some other? Um... Nothing to There's talk nothing about. Nothing to talk about. <coughs> hmm. Fine. I suppose you've opened enough for one day. Yes, let me go okay. home. Okay. One more question. Yeah, let me go this home. This is just a formality. Let me but go home. I have to ask, are you going to do it again? That's a hard one. Don't, I don't say know. that. Just say no. But, hey, I've got it. What have you got? The answer is no. I'm not. Thank you very much. Excellent. Oh my We're god. We're nearly done here. Are you serious? There's just one more thing I must You used to be a nurse, you. right? Why would you what do that? What exactly happened last night? You tried to kill well, yourself. after I'd met you outside the ward yesterday, I went back to my room and fell asleep. Mm -hmm. I slept really well, considering what happened earlier. But then someone woke me up. Liz. Chatty Liz. It was the same nurse who yep. was so friendly with me the first night. She said we needed to talk. Whoa, excuse me? We must go, Susan. You are not safe here. But... Please, what? you must follow me. Quickly. What? Holy crap. Okay, um... I'm gonna have to stop it here because this is really cool, but I'm already running a little bit long. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm really curious to see what happens next. I'm, I'm just, I'm ready to keep going. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys on the next MAMJ Let's Play.